Cairo, Riyadh The Arab League said that a more accurate approach was required in the annual report of the UN Secretary General on the situation of children in armed conflict, in which the UN accused the Arab coalition countries to restore Yemen's legitimacy of committing violations against children during the country's armed conflict. Mohamed Afifi, the official spokesman of the Arab League Secretary General, said that the report lacked a more accurate approach by the authors in monitoring, recording and documenting the alleged violations by Arab coalition in Yemen. He stressed that Yemen's complex situation and the responsibility of the coup militias for a large number of violations makes it important to refer to the legitimate government in Yemen as the main source for information and data in this regard. Afifi added that the severe deterioration in the humanitarian and living conditions of the Yemeni people necessitated practical steps to mobilize the much-needed efforts to address the situation as soon as possible, starting with a constructive and sound dialogue between the international community and the legitimate government and its allies. He also highlighted great efforts deployed by the Arab coalition over the last years to help the Yemeni people, including, for example, the work of the King Salman Humanitarian Aid and Relief Center, CS Relief, in the protection of Yemeni children in armed conflicts, and the rehabilitation of child soldiers. Meanwhile, legal sources said that the credibility and accuracy of United Nations reports was at stake as the international organization has recently resorted to inaccurate statistical data from non-neutral actors possibly involved in conflicts. The sources told the Shark al Asad that in recent years there has been an increase in the international organization's failures, while its secretary-general's tasks have been limited to denunciation and condemnation. Dr. Hadi al-Yami, the former chairman of the Arab Human Rights Committee, said that international organizations have tried to exploit Saudi support for their programs and to issue reports in the interests of the kingdom's enemies. He also expressed his surprise over the United Nations designation of the Arab coalition as a party that violates children's rights.